here in Frankfurt at ISC, Europe's largest supercomputing conference. There's been a lot of excitement around NVIDIA with the new top 500 list. Summit from Oak Ridge Labs in the US is now the fastest supercomputer in the world and the first to break the 100 petaflops barrier. 95% of its performance is driven by NVIDIA's Tensor Core GPUs. NVIDIA GPUs now power the fastest supercomputers in the US, in Europe, in Japan, and 17 of the top 20 green supercomputers. This rise in accelerated GPU computing allows researchers to fuse traditional model simulations with artificial intelligence to help solve the most challenging scientific problems much faster than before. We're also making it easy to use accelerated applications by launching nine new containers on our NVIDIA GPU cloud. What's the benefit? By simplifying the deployment of HPC applications, researchers can speed up scientific discoveries. And we now have 35 containers across deep learning, high-performance computing, and HPC visualization. One more point to note is that more than half of the new performance on the new uh, top 500 list is now being driven by NVIDIA GPUs. This is a clear indication that as Moore's law comes to an end, this is how supercomputers are going to be built in the future. Accelerated computing is clearly a path forward to exascale.